Hello everyone, my name is Daisy. I'm a 15-year-old girl living in Jakarta, Indonesia. Today, I will show you a day in my life in quarantine. In my typical day, I usually wake up at 7, take a shower, and join my online classes. During breaks, I usually take a nap since I stay up late at night playing games. Then, after school, I have tuition for about 1-2 to two hours. In my free time, other than playing games, I usually draw. I've been drawing since I was little but it was all just doodles. During quarantine, I started to take drawing more seriously and drew more finished pieces. I learned how to draw digitally and it was quite hard at first but I can definitely see an improvement in my drawing skills. You can check out my artworks on my Instagram page, DP Sketch. I would really appreciate it. This is my cat, Cats. He was given by my brother's friend five months ago. I think he's about seven months old right now. He sits with me every day and often wakes me up in the middle of the night. He also loves disturbing me during my classes, like meowing so loudly and sitting on my textbook. Even though he's a troublemaker, I still love him. These are my little sisters. They are trying to make my cat like them, but my cat only likes me. Say hi guys! First of all, each was really tiring even though we have shorter school hours and it is not as effective as physical school. I don't learn as easily as before and I get easily distracted in class. Then each day, I have to stare at my computer screen for about 8-9 to nine hours which causes my eyes to burn. But I guess there's no other choice and I just have to endure it. Despite all these things, I still experience some positive outcomes. For example, I became closer to my family members since they are the only people I can talk to physically. Then I think I became more responsible. During times like these, there isn't a physical teacher who could guide me step by step, so I need to control myself and fix my own mistakes. Of course, the teachers were still helpful and supportive, but it's just harder to remember things being taught online than at school. So, I need to revise more than usual to get good grades. Staying at home is really boring and I really want to meet my family and friends. Well, of course, I can't because I don't want them or me to catch the virus. I really feel bad for the people who are greatly affected by the virus. I really hope this pandemic will end soon. Thank you guys for watching this video. Have a great day.